31 years ago, Diane and I worked with the beginning of Habitat in Long Beach and the surrounding area. I brought Diane with me today. And this little picture was taken at Matt's and Kirsten's wedding. So Diane is here as a part of it. But I want to introduce you to somebody most of you have never heard about, the original founder of Habitat for Humanity in Long Beach. God's messenger was named Ira, Ira. Diane was on the International Advisory Committee for Millard Fuller. And our name, our phone number was published. And there came a phone call one day. Diane, my name is Ira. Why don't we have a habitat in Long Beach? And there came the normal song and dance. It's too expensive. Long Beach has building codes that just make it too expensive for us to build a habitat house in Long Beach. I want you to come to my home next week, Ira said to Diane. Next week, we gathered two blocks from here in Ira's house. And 12 people, we always thought that was very special, 12 people gathered in that home. We started the organization, thoughts about how to do it. And we planned to meet the next week in Ira's house and in calling to make those final arrangements to be in her home that next week, she was gone. She had fled immediately overnight, one night, to avoid a, an abusive house, an abusive home. And we never heard from her again. Not once, but Ira is the real founder of Habitat for Humanity, Long Beach, South Bay, eventually greater Los Angeles. We had a goal, Diane and I, and Wendy and Matt, of 10 houses in 10 years. It took us nine months to start the organization. It took us a year to build the first house, and it seemed appropriate that in 10 years we could build 10 houses. And it was wonderful, that the leadership that followed, Matt and Wendy, and then monumental progress through Aaron. Founding is important, but the follow through is essential. Godspeed and great thank you. So bringing Diane to be a part of it, we're gonna have her help lift the, 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 the wall and recognizing that Matt is our first president and Wendy was one of our first officers.